Hey, good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. Uh, just about ready to head out to work. Uh, my fruit fly culture is looking very nice. So time to start feeding. Um, I want to make sure I keep these fruit flies with the culture last or I'd like to get as much production out of them as possible. So I um, thought I'd share a quick video with my pogos. I'm going to go ahead and feed them this morning and just thought you guys would enjoy that. I'll be right back. And there we are. I'm going to try to keep this short, guys. i got to run to work. But let's get that angle right here. But, um, yeah, the pogos are doing really well. I've had a couple of viewers ask me to do a video on some of the challenges I've had with the pogo. This is my first successful pogo colony thus far. And I have had some challenges with these guys. Um, so I will probably do a video this weekend, share with you some of the challenges that I have had. Um, but for the purpose of this video, when I'm talking about my culture, when you buy a culture of uh, fruit flies, not from like the, you know, a big box store, but an actual pet store, uh, usually you have a few fruit flies in there and then they lay eggs and larvae and yada yada. And uh, when I start to get a lot of adults, I want to try to utilize, I want to try to get those in, uh, get them fed and uh, leave the food at the very bottom of the culture for the new fruit flies. And I usually get about two, two and a half, three weeks out of, um, a fruit fly culture they cost about ten dollars but i get a lot of feedings out of them and um the ants seem to like the fruit flies are small they can um they usually build a pile of them and then uh well put the larvae you know circle the larvae around the, the fruit flies for feeding after they've caught them so um it's it's a good food and i, I do that i do uh, crickets baby cockroaches feeding cockroaches mealworms super worms fruits um, all kinds of different stuff and uh you know, these guys, they, they like the fruit flies, they like seeds, they definitely like their seeds, you know, harvester ants, Pogon Americs, harvester ants, they're uh, AKA. So, um, so yeah, but this colony has been doing very, very well. Um, you know, I don't want to get in, I don't want to get into a, an in-depth uh, video. I got to get out, get to work. But, um, yeah, I caught the queen. Um, she had her, her first nanictic way late compared to all my other ants that I caught at the same time. I was very um, pessimistic that this colony would uh, survive, but um, had the first anectic and then um, started laying a lot of eggs, had a healthy brood, and then the colony has just exploded, um, sort of speak, you know, relatively speaking. But um, I've been very, very pleased with the, the success of the colony so far, and I hope to have... Uh, more success, but they're all very active, uh, a lot of personality with this colony, uh, and very easy to keep thus far. Um, you know, I was, again, early on, I wasn't, uh, I wasn't really optimistic that they'd, su they'd survive, but, <coughs> excuse me, they are doing very well. Let's go and take a quick peek inside the nest. And there they are. So as you can see, they are doing very, very well. Very healthy brood. Got some seeds in there. It's probably I'm just I'm just doing a um, uh, a bird seed melody type thing, um, and they're taken to it. They bring them in. They do their thing with them, and they take the waste back out. But um, yeah, let's see if we can zoom in and seeing what they're see what they're doing with those fruit flies that they've just caught. They'll just kind of create a pile of them around the uh, the brood, and you can see them bringing. Uh, they're messing with some seeds. So what I'm going to do, guys, I got to run back into the house, um, grab a couple things before. Uh, well, there's a fruit fly running around inside. Yeah. Oh, did he get away? Hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and leave this view on. I'm going to run inside real quick and just let the, the camera roll and then um, come back out. 
and call it a video. guys have we seen anything interesting what a healthy looking colony i love these guys you guys uh if you have any other questions like i said i'll do a quick video over the weekend regarding some of the some of the challenges i've had with this particular colony and the pogo numerics in general but uh, until then if you have any questions please um comment i i do read all the comments so i'm sorry if i don't uh, respond to you but i do read all of them and try to at least give you a like um some recognition for making a comment um, for other people that are into this, please like and share with them, you know, help get these videos out. If you want to keep seeing them, I, again, I, I got into, you know, ant keeping. I, I won't go into that now, but, you know, I enjoy it. I like sharing the videos and I don't know if you guys, these are definitely not well produced like some of the other folks out there, but I like to give you just raw videos of my ants and, um, I just do one cuts. I don't do a lot of editing down the road. I may, but right now I just hit record, do do raw cuts and you you see what i you know type of video so if you guys are looking for something else please comment let me know and please like and share thanks guys have a wonderful weekend